All right, guys, before we get into the video, let's talk about foottrading.co.uk. Every single method you see in my videos can be found over on the website with buying and selling prices for almost every single card on the game. £10 a month gets you access to tier one buying prices. That's icons, special cards, silvers, and Thursday flips. For £15 a month, you get access to tier two. That gives you live filters, gold chem styles, UCL cards, and our amazing area of fluctuations where the market is continually monitored for highs and lows. You guys are then notified when to buy low and buy and sell high, basically a really easy way to make coins. We've recently introduced a tier three, thanks to you guys asking for us to develop a bot, basically. We came up with a program and what it does is it pings you every single minute, pretty much. I think it's every three minutes. You will get pings telling you when cards are low and what to sell those cards for. I'm gonna show you an example of that now. I'll be right back. All right, guys, and this is the area of the Discord for tier three users. As you can see, it is pinging you guys with the current price of these cards and the live target sell price. You have to cross-reference that with what the sell price has been recently and use some of your own market knowledge, but this runs 24 hours a day to make sure you guys are getting continual deals that you can keep making coins from. The legitimate way, a new ping's just come up right there for new cards that you can go out right now, buy and sell. So check it out, get involved, foottrading.co.uk. But for now, let's get into the video. Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to a new video with me, Fuzzball40. As always, if you're new around here, make sure you subscribe down below and make sure your notifications are turned on so you never miss an upload. Don't forget to check out the previous trading videos. This video goes live just before Division Rivals and Weekend League Rewards. There is still time to make coins on this game for you guys to basically improve your team before Weekend League because as you guys know from last weekend, Weekend League is very, very sweaty right now with the tots that are on offer. It is non-stop sweat, so make sure you check it out. But this is a brand new episode of the Road to Glory and we're, I think, day 9 now, day 10 of the Road to Glory on this account and it has been absolutely ridiculous so far. La Liga Tots really has put the club in a position that I didn't think we would be in. So this is basically what we have at the moment in the club, which is ridiculous. We've ground and we've worked hard to do what we've done, um, but there is a lot here. There's a lot, a lot, a lot here and... I've got to sort of find a way that I can utilise this to build a good team for Weekend League, whilst also potentially putting some of these cards into SBCs to improve my team. Now, it's likely I go very La Liga heavy. I think a lot of people will this weekend because everyone keeps packing these cards. Um, and so I think that's where most people are going to lie, and I think that's where I'm going to lie with what I'm doing. But I also have 600 and something K tucked away that if I want to improve the team in some way, shape or form, I still can do that. And today's going to be about grinding that out. Yesterday, we saw me do the 84 times 20. We've got Navas in that. We've got some duplicate tots in that. We're up to 33 tots pack now, which is with no FIFA points spent. So I'm really proud of that. But this is where we're at at the moment. And so today's going to be a mixture of a lot of different stuff. So the first, first thing's going to be about spending some of those coins to make coins, to trading, to get some pro profit back and whatnot. Gives me a bit of flexibility with what I do with Weekend League. So that's the first thing. We're also going to see La Liga to, uh, Tots are guaranteed tonight, almost certainly. So we'll be opening that up because outside of these ones here, we still do have a Moreno and a Rosier, both um, untradable duplicate. These can both be put into that or into another SBC. Um, but ideally, I, I want the basis for my team done today. We may get onto some icon swaps as well. Um, but given that the next thing that I'm going to do is probably going to be the pack for um, the icon pack, most likely is what I'm probably going to go for with this set of, of swaps tokens. Um, realistically, I've got to do the Bundesliga and League 1, two of these, so we'll do that at the same time, and then we're left basically with one of Rivals or Weekend League. Now, as I'm going to do Weekend League anyway, part of me is just like, I might as well get that pack done over the weekend, because we've got so much content in the game right now, it doesn't really matter that much in terms of where we're at. Um, but I have to get a rough idea of it. So my thought process at the moment is to use the Spanish links as much as I possibly can, um, to try and get Marcus Alonso into the team. I'm very tempted to do Gerard Pique. I'm, in, I'm incredibly tempted to do Gerard Pique. Um, it isn't the fastest centre-back in the world, but I've used centre-backs like that this year, and they're still relatively usable. I know a lot of people are just like, oh, stick Trippier here. Sorry, stick Trippier here. Put Navas right back and whatnot and use a fullback meta. And there is a chance that I do that. I'm not going to sit and pretend like I'm, I'm definitely not going to. Um, but I just don't like that. I'm not going to lie to you. I'm, I'm not a massive fan of it. So... We'll see how it goes. I, I, I won't sit here and be like, oh, I'm never going to do it because there's a chance that I do. Um, but we'll see how things go for that day. So what I'm going to go and do now is head over to our Discord, the Tier 3 bot, look at Footbin and just get some trades done. I'll show you them when we buy them. Um, and then we're just going to, throughout the day, just sort of grind it out, do bits and bobs like that. Once we've got that done and once we've got that into position that we need to be, we'll probably then look at 6pm content and go from there. 
And then obviously you guys will see my rewards tomorrow's video. Fingers crossed we can get something good from those for my picks. So I'll be right back. I'll see you soon. All right, so I've just done a few buys uh, so far. This Mendy we picked up for 32, so for 39. Harlem was 45, so 52. And this Vinicius, we picked up two of them. Um, I'll know what I sold them for because I picked up the same amount. 32.5. Decent little bits of profit on these. These guys here, we've got Ericsson at 49, selling for 56. Obviously, Vinicius at 32. Lozano at 35, selling for 29. Nothing that massive on that. Uh, Jesus at 99. He will sell for 112, but he's a bit of a pain in the backside to sell. Edison's 55 and 56. These will do well tomorrow either way. But because of his tots, it can be an iffy buy. Um, and then Campbell for 199. Now, I don't normally buy Campbell. However, I sold them yesterday for 230 quite easily. But I did just see one get massively undercut, which is a bit annoying um, on the market at the moment. Yeah, so 220 has been dipped onto the market right now. So we'll leave that to go. Once that goes, the Campbell will eventually go at 230. So good buys all in all. They're not bad. I've still got 120 to spend, so I'll probably flip some silvers in the meantime. Um, I, d I think I do want a break <laughs> in some way, shape or form from, from Icon Swaps. Um, just so that I've given myself a bit more time to... To grind out like other bits and bobs, bit of trading or whatever. Uh, but we will get back into icon swaps either way. We'll, we will be banging out the the two that I want to do. The problem is I've seen really bad, really bad 83 times 25 and 81 times 25s. Uh, but because I've committed now, I've sort of got no choice but to go with the old uh, with the packs. These ones here basically, um, as a dog's bark as usual. Uh, but yeah, so we've got the icon moments pack there, which is we're going we're definitely going to go for an 81 times 25. But I've seen these two be very very bad up till now. The other partner was like, do I go for Schweinsteiger and just give myself a good central midfielder? But his pace is just too iffy. Like, really, really too iffy. So anyway, I'm going to keep trading, making some coins. As always, 6 p.m. is really the big one today. I want my Iago Aspas, EA. Give me Iago Aspas. I'll be right back. All right, guys. So I've been waiting for stuff to sell. I bought loads of stuff. It will sell overnight for profit either way. Um, I thought I might as well make myself useful. So I've gone ahead and done um, some of the Icon Swap stuff for the Bundesliga. So right now, you're going to see some gameplay footage because you guys seem to love that. I will try and get in the habit of commentating over the gameplay if I possibly can in the future. Um, but it is very, very time consuming. And with double videos every day, it can be hard to do. But so enjoy the montage that Yellen's probably about to put together for you guys with the gameplay. I'll see you after that. I'll be right back. First time in so long you felt the heat Evaporating your bindings Move like the sunlight, darkness can't hold you here Bold and bright, push through the atmosphere This is your dawn, this is your break Move like the, move like the, move like the sunlight Darkness can't hold you I don't get too excited, but I think that is that. I think that is the Bundesliga token done. Um, yeah, it's so I can't stop this. So toxic. Some guy lost his mind because he paused for me. I refuse to leave the game, but I believe. That is the Bundesliga finished um, for Icon Swaps, which it is with the team we just used. I'm pretty happy with that. So that's our Icon Swaps token done. Next time you guys see me, it will be uh, 6 p.m. Give me Iago Ias. Uh, give me Iago Ias. Give me Iago EA. I'll see you at 6 p.m. All right, guys. It's 6 p.m. Um, and we've got the La Liga tots guaranteed, as you can see on your screen. 87 rated. It's a little bit steep. Um, there are loads of good cards in this. Obviously, the problem I've got is I pretty much packed half of the La Liga tots already. Um, so I'm probably going to get a duplicate here. However, we have also got a 85 plus player pick again. Um, that's come back again. Uh, what's the requirement on this time? Where is it? There we are. It's 85 rated again. So it's back with 85 rated a Liga player pick. So whatever happens, he, it can go into that no matter what happens. I'm putting the Moreno and the Rosier into this either way. The player SBT today is weak in my opinion. I'm not a massive fan of this. Thibaut Courtois. It's not expensive SPC by any stretch of the imagination. 80 rated with team of the week and a team of the season. 
obviously the season, 84 rated team of the week, team of the season. It's not an expensive SBC. But why Courtois? Why another goalkeeper? We don't really need another goalkeeper. Um, it's just a bit of a random one that it's a bit meh, if I'm honest with you. PK's still tempting me. I've got another sort of two days on him. So obviously with rewards tomorrow, I can decide what I do there. But yeah, it's just a bit meh. I'm not going to lie to you. Today's the first sort of meh day we've got. So we can't complain too much because it's been good. But I do think that La Liga Tots guaranteed is a little bit, a little bit overpriced. Now I'm doing this because I hope to get someone that I haven't got yet. I'd be happy with anyone I haven't got yet. And um, that would help massively into weekend league. But I think 87 is a bit steep. The reason they have done that is because fodder's everywhere at the moment. You've got icon swaps and everything. So fodder is everywhere either way. Um, let me send the stuff to club that we've got here. So send those two to club again so they'll get replenished into the club. We'll get rid of this TFOS pack because literally who cares? No one. Um, right, so we've got 25k pack from doing some sort of objective value on. I think I think it was the like friendlies. Scoring X amount with friendlies or doing whatever it is. Winning X amount of friendlies. We do get a walkout in it which is, which is nice. We'll take that all day long. And it's going to be Spanish. And it's going to be Cam. It's going to be David Silva. I just put David Silva into this, so we'll take that. We don't mind that one bit. Love a good TFO pack. Yeah, it's, everyone, everyone loves a TFO pack. <laughs> all, all the TFO packs. We'll get this stuff here, put it together. Trust all the tradable. You are, you are, you're not. Cool. And so, guaranteed La Liga Tots. If it's one we haven't got, perfect. If it was one we have got, we'll put it straight into the 85 plus pick. Because why not? Guaranteed La Liga Tots. Who are we getting in this one? It's going to be Spanish. It's going to be Striker. It's going to be Moreno, like I said it would be. Moreno from the SBC that I just put Moreno into. Um, yeah, it is what it is. So duplicate Moreno is never like inevitable. I'm gonna go and put him into the 85 plus double now. 85 plus player pick even. And we'll go from there. I'll be right back. Alright, and so we have got the 85 plus player pick to do. And so basically between this and what we get tomorrow, that'll determine what our weekend league team is gonna be. Um, I'm hoping that from this we don't get someone we've already got. But if we do again, it can go into an SBC. Ideally, just not Gerard Moreno again would be the ideal situation to find ourselves in. And we get one that I actually wanted. That's a dub. Jordi Alba. We love to see it. That is worth it. We are happy with that. We take that one all day long. So that is Jordi Alba going into the club. That is massive. Is that, yeah, it's like 400k. I know that's absolutely massive. Because the left-back spot that I was debating is now sorted. If we pop Marcus Alonso up here. If we pock him, pock, pock him down there. Pock, if we pock. We don't want to pock him. We want to pop him. Down there. We go left-back. And we stick our Jordi Alba in there. That is an absolutely massive, massive pull for the team for Weekend League. To save me a lot of coins. I'm probably going to end up getting him on my picks anyway. But either way, he's 93 hour, but I am massively happy with that. So I'm going to go away now. I'm going to do some more stuff on stream. But I'll be back with you guys on YouTube to talk about what I plan on doing with the team this weekend. I'll be right back. All right, guys. So after the hype of that Alba, um, we are in a very, very good place. La Liga has been kind to us. Um, I'm, I'm probably going to take the, the, the team the route of La Liga this week. But I've just had a little look. And Butcher Gueno Prime at the moment on the market. Uh, let's just make that that way. But it's 5.30. I've just seen one. 5.34 there. 5-2-8 there. So there's a chance that I'm going to try and get some of the stuff I've got listed sold tonight and get Butra bought. Because him and Isak up top this weekend, two five-star weak foot strikers for me would be great. Potentially for Kia there. I've got about 800k to spend. Now, this is what I've got here without even doing anything for foot champs rewards tomorrow. I've still got two picks to come, all those packs to come. And this is where we're at in terms of the squad. It's a good place. It's a very, very good place. I'm still debating doing PK. Now, if any of you have done PK... Please tell me, because um, I'm very interested to see if he's good or not, and whether he's worth doing, because part of me wants to do him really badly. But I need to know if he's good or not. Um, so I don't, I don't really want to do the fullback at centre-back meta, but I may have to. Uh, but really, tomorrow's going to come down to what we get from our picks. You never know, we might get lucky and pick it around. Um, but we've got two packs to get here. These are two of the daily TOTS, uh, t daily tots SBCs. Bear in mind, this account is no more than 10 days old. No more than 10 days old. And this is what we've achieved in that time. Wilfred and Didi here is not bad. Um, and that's just been grind and hard work. It's been very, very good. I'm very proud of what we've done so far. It's just a case now of pushing on to see if we can finally get any extra bits done. Any of stuff tradable here? Go on, go on, full house. Oh, I'm going to mean it lets us down. So send in there. So to end it all off, we're going to have a jumbo premium goal players pack. Make sure you check me out on YouTube live today at 10 a.m. We'll be opening up my rewards there and getting the team built for weekend leagues. So make sure you chat out. We do get a board in this jumbo premium goal players pack. It's going to be Portuguese and it's going to be goalkeeper. It's going to be Patricio. Not too bad. But that's the end of the video. If you are new around here, as always, make sure you subscribe down below. Make sure your notifications are turned on so you never miss an upload. But for now, I am out. Peace out. I'll speak to you soon.